Hi guys, so today I'm going to show you how to make a butterfly blossom bracelet. I'm going to show you uh, right here. They are really cute and they look like flowers and they look really cool on people's wrists. Okay, so first you take three colors. One color has to be black or white. I mean, no, actually no, it doesn't. But you get three colors. My colors today are orange, black, and white. Okay. So my first color is orange. You put it from this pin to this pin. Okay. And you get the same color, orange, this pin to this pin. And you go from this pin to this pin. This pin to this pin. This pin to this pin. And then this pin to the Ooh. this pin to this pin. Okay, so here comes the, the part of it. It's sort of like the honeycomb, actually. So you hold it to the side, you hold this down, and you twist it into an 8, and put it on the peg in front of it, like that. And then you do it to the other side. Look at that. Okay, I'm going to show you one more time. So my next color will be black. And you go from here, where this one ended, that's where you start the next one. V. There we go. That's how this one was. You do same thing. Get your white. Make it eight across. Make it eight across. There we go. And do that all the way up with the colors that you would like. Okay. So make sure to watch my other videos. They can help you with the rainbow one too. I made two other ones. One's a honeycomb, and one is the one I made up, which I think is really cool. Okay. These bracelets, well, these are good to sell at school, because I know that I would sell them at my school, and a lot of kids at my school don't have the rainbow room, and I love the bracelets. Sorry, notification. So, Okay. And 
once you are all the way up, that's what it should look like. The end. Okay, then you flip your template over. Okay. Okay, your loom hook. My loom hook has a bracelet I made up on it, so I forgot to put it. Okay, so this is the hard part to show you. Okay, so you get the same color rubber band where you end it. Mine is white. Put a triangle at the end. Okay. Go from here. You get the first rubber band and pulled it over from where it came from. And then you get this rubber band. Pull it over from where it came from. Okay, then you go under to the folded ones that you just did and get the bottom white one. And you should fold it up so it looks like an 8. Then you go to the other side and fold that part up. See? And then after that you go to the bottom and get the bottom white. And put it over on the peg where it came from. Then do that on the other side. Okay. So when you've done the first one, you go under and get the first of the next color. So I would get the first of the black. You get the first of whatever color that you are working with. And fold it over from where it came from. Then you go under the big pile of white, the next color, I go under the big pile of white, and there we go, it looks like little reindeer ears, and you go under that, get the black, get the black under, the bottom black, uh, hate it when the rubber band falls off. Can you let me fix this real quick? Yay! Fixed it. Pull it over. Like that, like you did with this one. Then you go to the other side, get the bottom black, fold it over from where it came from. There we go. And you get the top. Fold it over to the peg where it came from. Go to the next side and fold it over from where the peg came from. And do that all the way up. You don't touch the whites that you put into eights. Okay. Introducing new Olay Fresh Effect Cleansers, part of a lineup of unstoppable skincare. Start fresh and finish sparkling with swipe out wet cloths. And I, I don't just use my loom hook, I use my fingers, because I think that is much easier than just using the loom hook, because sometimes it'll just flip right off the loom hook. And if you drop it off the loom hook while you're using your fingers, you'll still have it in your hand, so that it won't flip off. Okay. I should turn my TV on. Turn that off. 
Okay. So. Almost done. If you guys need any help, just go back in the video. Watch the parts that you missed. If you missed any. Okay. So, once you have finished and you are back where you started, you get any rubber band. I chose a white. You put your loom hook through it. And pull it through. There. Now you can start to take your bracelet off. At first, when you start to take it off, it will look a little messed up. So that's why I need to fix it. take a little longer than everyone else to take it off because I take it off peg by peg. I don't want it to ruin. There we go. There it is. It looks really cute. And if you want to fix the rubber bands, you can. I'll just leave them for now. Okay. There we are. Then I'll make an extension video for every kind of bracelet so I don't have to make an extension every time. So thank you for watching and watch my extension video to finish your bracelet.